It's your boy Lagan24 coming at you with some World at War on the PS3 with my boy Swifty. What's going on, everybody? This was my first time ever playing World at War. Shit's been out for years, and I just bought it yesterday. This, I think, was my third or fourth game. You can see I'm a rank six, so I didn't play very... I haven't played very long up to this point that you're watching right now, but man, did I figure it out. So I guess once you've played one Call of Duty, you've played them all, but this one didn't piss me off at all. I played like 15 games and didn't get mad once, so enjoy that in the background, and you can tell by the title of my video, it's called Sunday Sit Down, and basically it's just a day that I want to chill, connect with my subs, talk about whatever's on my mind, it could be a movie, it could be my night out at the bar with the guys, it could be about a video game, basically uh, just nothing planned, I'm just going to talk about stuff, and the thing I want to talk to you about today, and this has been on my mind a lot, Okay, and it's my favorite fucking time of year because fall is right around the corner and I absolutely, hands down, love the fall. Okay, for me, because I live on the coast in the southeast of the United States, uh, we don't have a very long winter. It's very, it's a very mild winter. Our winter is from like, I don't know, late December through February. So two, two months, two months and a couple of weeks. But fall seems to last a good little while. It, Late September, all of October, all of November, most of December is fall weather. Brisk, nice, cool air. I love it because you can sleep with your windows open at night and get that nice chilly air in there and you get to bundle in your fucking blanket. It just It's such a good feeling. And there's certain types of food that are better in the fall, like a, a big-ass bowl of chili or, you know, hot soup. Oysters, we do a lot of uh, oyster roast out here um, in the south during the fall, and that's basically just cooking oysters over an open fire and just shucking them and eating them. It's great. It's great during the cold weather. Get your beer next to you. It's just a lot of fun. You know, the leaves change color during the fall. They turn all orange and red and shit, and that's supposedly pretty. I think it's pretty. I don't know. Does that make me gay? I don't think so. I like colored leaves, all right? I don't like green leaves all year long. Halloween. Now, I don't know how you guys do it in the rest of the world, but Halloween's kind of big over here. And you don't have to be a kid to enjoy Halloween. Certainly the kids dress up and go trick-or-treating, and I get that. But the adults, man, even the adults dress up, and they all go to bars, or they go to house parties, and the girls dress like sluts. And it's just an amazing time of year. Halloween's great. I think Swifty's going to come join me next October here in the United States for his first trip over. And we're gonna be, I'm going to show him how we do Halloween over here in the States, which is just a lot of fun. You know, sports get really good this time of year as well. You got the NFL football kicking off. I'm a huge New York Giants fan, big NFL fan. Uh, baseball, the playoffs start in October. So it's just it's a fantastic time of year for sports. Uh, and then not to mention one of my greatest loves, and that's TV shows. I love watching TV shows. Um, I've got a job. I go out and do other things besides sit around, play video games, and watch TVs. But there are some shows that are, are, are a must-sees for me. And their new episodes return in the fall. So How I Met Your Mother is a great comedy. I love watching that, so I'm looking forward to those new episodes. The Big Bang Theory, The Mentalist, which is sort of like a, a crime investigation show, but they use, like a, they use like a con artist who pretends to be a psychic and basically tricks people into admitting that they, they did the crime and killed the person. It's really clever. I like that show. Sons of Anarchy, basically Sopranos on the motorcycles. Uh, it's just a motorcycle gang. Uh, it's a really cool show, nice drama, good action, lots of deaths. It's fantastic. And then, of course, okay, new video games that are coming out this fall that I can't wait for are Resident Evil 6. And you guys have seen my channel. I like playing all kind of zombie games, and Resident Evil 6 is no exception. I'll be buying that day one and playing it and putting out a Let's Play of that for sure. And then, of course, Assassin's Creed 3. Uh, I've only played one Assassin's Creed. I think it was Assassin's Creed 2, but I really enjoyed it. I wish I had played some more, um, but I'm definitely going to buy Assassin's Creed 3. And can't forget about Black Ops 2. I went out and pre-ordered the Hardened Edition today, so I got that Zombies uh, Nuketown 2025, which you can only get if you pre-order the Hardened or the Care Package Edition. It will not be available later in a DLC, as tweeted out by David Vonderhart a couple of days ago on Twitter. Um, you can still get Nuketown 2025, but you won't be able to get the Zombies 2025 unless you pre-order those things I said. And then Thanksgiving's around the corner. Watch out, we got a squeaker alert coming up. Thanksgiving's my favorite holiday. Lots of food. You son of a bitch, shut up. Lots of food and family and friends. So this has been your boy Lagging24, and I will see you next time.